everyone my name is pastor rajesh kere thank you so much for watching this video god bless you and your family and it's going to be a wonderful message today it's it's a short message but it's going to bless you by god grace let's go to isaiah 61:7 to 9 instead of your shame you shall have double honor my dear brother sister if you're going to a shame today let me tell you you shall have double honor that's the promise of god let's pray almighty and awesome father god thank you so much for tuning into this video god bless you and your family lord jesus bless those who are watching this video bless them spiritually physically and financially thank you so much for this time i pray all this is most loving and lord savior jesus christ amen instead of your shame you shall have double honor maybe today you are going through a shame now let me tell you this these are not my words these are the words of the living god see when man talks we have to think of so many things but this is god talking to you instead of your shame you shall have double honor so maybe today you are going through a shame maybe the people are laughing at you maybe the the neighbors are talking bad about you maybe you don't have any respect in society today your office colleagues are not respecting you they are not giving you honor your relatives are making fun of you people are making fun of your family they are talking bad about your family there is no respect for you and your family but instead you have a shame maybe marriage is not happening maybe you are not getting married and that's why people are talking a lot of bad things about you maybe you are poor that's why people are ridiculing you maybe your husband has left you or your wife has left you and that's why people are talking bad about you maybe there are fights in the family and and the neighbors are just ridiculing your family maybe your husband comes drunk every single day and he creates and he creates a havoc in your family and your name is spoiled among your neighbors today you are going to a shame today you are going to a shame but let me tell you the word of god says you will have a double honor now why we will have a double honor it's very important to find out why we will have a double honor for our shame let's go to isaiah 56 say offered my back to those who beat me my cheeks to those who pull out my beard i did not hide my face for mocking and spitting these are the words of lord jesus christ you know why we receive double honor because of what lord jesus christ had done on the cross of calvary because he took all our shame he took all our mocking so that today we can have a double honor you know what it says here i did not hide my face from mocking and spitting you know people were mocking at lord jesus christ the son of god the god people were mocking at him people were spitting at him not just one person but 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 people were just spitting on his face he went to all the humiliation for us so that today we can have a double honor my dear brothers sisters and friends today we can have double honor because of what lord jesus christ had done on the cross of calvary he took all our shame so that today we can have a double honor so believe in this you will receive the double honor you know joseph he was he was sold as a slave it's so humiliating to be sold as a slave and that period before the owners take you you have to be full naked so that owner can see you to check whether you have any skin infection or not so it was just it was just humiliation joseph at the age of 17 he was sold as a slave in egypt and at the age of 30 he became the governor of the egypt he received the double honor and secondly betsheba you know the betsheba son solomon God chose him as the successor to David. Now David has many wives, many sons, but God chose Bathsheba's son Solomon to be the king. So God gave double honor to Bathsheba. Because she was the one where where people must have talked a lot of bad thing about her. People must have talked oh, she is the one who enticed David. But Bathsheba went through all the humiliation and finally she received the double honor. So let me tell you friends you will receive a double honor for your shame. The same people who 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 worked you, the same people who dishonored you, they will honor you. 
the same neighbors who talk bad thing about you they will respect you and will start talking good thing about you you will be a respected man in your society people will honor you in your office your relatives will honor you maybe people are ridiculing you because you are poor you will have a plenty your cup will overflow your family will be a blessed family for others you will receive the double honor for your shame because of what lord jesus christ has done on the cross of calvary he took all our shame so that we can have the double honor today he took all our sickness so that we'll be free from every sickness he took all our sins so that we'll be free from sin and we go to heaven so let's thank god for what god has done on the cross of calvary because today we can have a double honor if you're going to a shame my dear friends you will have a double honor believe in this let's pray almighty and awesome father god thank you so much for this time i pray all this most living lord sir jesus christ amen